Hello, hello, hello everyone, and welcome to another episode of Ship Views with me, Carburetor. Today we are going to be looking at the Black Friday event in World of Warships. Just a couple of quick notes, a um, couple of little quick updates. First off, I had a video planned for you guys for the Japanese light cruisers, but I biffed it. I kind of made a big oopsie, and I was too ashamed to put it on the board, or to put it on YouTube. I'll admit to it right now, what I did is, when you buy multiple of the random bundles in the in these early access events, and this is still relatively new, so there's a reason why I didn't know about it, that's my excuse, I'm sticking to it. But, okay, it doesn't say it anymore, but when you buy multiple bundles, you get a discount. When you buy that discount, you get, or when you buy enough, you get a discount. I had bought $100 worth, however, if I had bought two more containers, it would have actually gone down because I would have gotten into the next, into the next, uh, into the next, uh, I just lost my train of thought, into the next, um, discount bracket. So it literally would have gone like 2,500, 2,600, 2,800, 2,300, or 23,000, sorry, all those thousands, not hundreds. So I was kind of embarrassed, so I didn't put it in. But anyway, let's move on from that. Um, one other quick note is I am unfortunately no longer in sumo. I am going to miss them. I hold no animosity towards them. I just decided that it was time for me to maybe move on. I might end up going back to them at some point. I do hold them in very high regard, but we will see. I am currently now with uh, Sea Lord Mountain Batten's Clan, which is T2 IOF, which is this sh this ship is on fire, and so far I've had a pretty good experience with them. They are a little different organized than I am used to, but I'm hoping to learn from them a little bit and to try and grow myself out. I don't really like change all that much. <laughs> But anyway, let's go into the Black Friday event, which is why everybody is here. Black Friday is here. So very first thing we're going to do is we're going to, going to go through these sequential bundles. If anybody is going to invest any money into this game, I would recommend investing it here. Now, I realize that not everybody can invest the money. But in my opinion, for... I forget how much I goes into this. I need to, I made a spreadsheet for this. So I'm going to be putting the spreadsheet up as I talk about this, but for 8,953 doubloons, you get the equivalent of 43,117 doubloons, and that whole spreadsheet will be right up here for you guys to see right now. It should be on the screen if editing carburetor remembers to put it up. Now, a few things I want to just touch on. There was a few, like, I had to guesstimate, so Black Friday 2022 container. You can typically buy a premium container for right around a thousand doubloons. So this is kind of a less than premium container. So I decided to award it a value of 750 doubloons. The Warships Premium account, if we go into your uh, account tab in game and you go down here and purchase premium, one day of premium is 250 doubloons, two days, 500 doubloons. Uh, 2x more coal containers. That is actually going to be, I'm going to leave it at, at 3,000, I, I'm just because I'm already going to have put this up, but I figured that one of those containers is worth right around 1,500 doubloons. 2x Black Friday 2022 containers, obviously 1,500 doubloons, 1 million credits. Unfortunately, that's not an exact translation. I chose to put 667 doubloons, but it's basically 66, uh, 666 and a half doubloons. So I'll let you choose how to interpret that. Two X rare bonuses containers. I decided to award those a value of twelve hundred and fifty doubloons. Set of signals was very difficult. I decided to award one hundred doubloons per signal. There are seven pairs of signals, so seven hundred doubloons. Black Friday twenty twenty two premium container twelve hundred fifty doubloons. That's what you can purchase them for a single down below. Seventy five thousand Commander X. Elite Commander XP, I've found that Elite Commander XP is a little less, little less than, than half the value of Convert XP or Free XP. I just so decided to give it a value of half. I will let you interpret if that is a good translation or not. 
4x rare bonuses containers. I again value of um I decided to give those a value of 1250. So 5,000 doubloons, 7x Black Friday containers, 15,000 coal is really tripped me up. I've spent the last hour trying to find a way to convert that. I finally figured out that it's worth about 1,300 doubloons. Now that's just looking at all of the all of the premium ships that you can buy for coal and for doubloons. Depending on which ship you look at, I averaged them all out and got right around 1,270. But if you're looking at higher ships, it's worth about 1,400. I'm gonna make a whole a whole video on that and let you know what how I did it. That'll be again a future video. The 2x Black Friday 2022 premium containers, pretty ex self explanatory. There, 60,000 free XP. Just go up and figure out how much 60,000 free XP is worth. The 2x unique bonuses commander or bonuses containers. I decided to give those two a value of 2,000 doubloons simply because red containers are so valuable. People really want these things, but I don't think they're quite worth 3,000 doubloons, which is what some of the premium containers are in the armory. W World of Warships premium account, that's pretty self-explanatory, uh, 2x Black Fridays, and then the Shinonome B. Shinonome B is really not for sale anymore. I kind of had to kind of ball it at what you can buy it for doubloons. Um... Uh, I would value it at around 5,000 to 5,300 doubloons. I chose to give it a value of 5,300 doubloons. But no matter how you slice this, even if you round them all down, you're still getting one heck of a deal here. So if you're going to invest, I would definitely recommend investing in this way. Let's go through and let's buy them all. And then you can see if I get anything special. You saw I had no containers in my port. So let's go in and let's purchase them. This only one doubloon for two more coal containers. If you only have a few, I would definitely recommend at least getting to that. And I don't really need premium days. I wish I could skip those, but uh, beggars can't be choosers. I don't even know what's in the in the regular Black Friday containers. Like I have no idea of what's in those. But if, if you go back to that list also, there's not one deal on there where I think you're getting a bad deal if you just purchase one of those just outright. Like there's no, like it doesn't trip you up and, you know, oh, in order to proceed, you're going to have to make a bad deal. No, like they're all a decent deal. You're not going to lose money at, or you're not going to lose value at any, uh, at any of those, uh, at any of these purchases in the sequential bundle. I do also kind of wish they would just let me buy all these. Like, I don't like that I have to go through and do this. And there's a shit in all my B. That's all of them purchased. Let's go out and see if we got anything cool. Hmm. I can earn doubloons by earning 4,000 base XP playing this ship or the standard shit in my. Let's go take a look at that right quick. I'm, I'm curious about that. So I can get some money back. Not all of it, but some. That's definitely something to look at. So let's go through and let's see if I want anything good. 25 containers. Let's start. Ooh, starting right with the premium. I love the value, or I love the look on these. 100,000 Elite Commander XP. I'm not going to say no. Definitely getting those, uh, these unique rewards. <gasps> I should have looked to see if there's a pity, uh, there's a pity draw on this, where if you get so many in a row and you don't get anything, you get a ship guaranteed. Oh, you only get three of those? Oh, oh. 
So I really stick by my doubloon rating line. If I was getting like seven lows, I might have considered saying they're more valuable. All right, we're back to these. 6,000 free XP, it's nothing to sniff at. Oh, what did I get? Oh, I must have, must have registered the uh, Shinonome B going into my port. Typically, that's the sound you get when you earn a ship. I wonder what's up with that. Or maybe I already got, maybe I already got the ship and it, the ship that gave me and it uh, just didn't register. I do love the animation on these. These are always really cool. But I wonder why they made them look like milk jugs. This is what I was talking about how also where I, I'm getting 20,000 uh, Elite Commander XP and I'm only getting 6,000 free XP. That's a value of less than half. Uh, I'll let you guys choose where the value on that lies. To me, I'm happy with awarding it a value of half, but maybe it's only worth 1,000 instead of 1,500. Don't need any premium account. Gonna have a lot of elite commander XP after this. Well, looks like we're just into the uh, unique rewards or the rare bonuses or whatever these are. <laughs> yeah, these are rare bonuses containers. Oh, well, now we're into the coal. All right, and that looks like it's it. I was hoping maybe I might get a super container out of that because you can get super containers from, from those. But anyway... Still got the Shinonome B. We didn't get any ships, unfortunately. I'm just curious if there's a pity, uh, if there's a pity function where if you open so many in a row, you don't, uh, where if you open so many in a row, you're guaranteed to drop. Alright, this is where the pity function is. You are guaranteed to find an item from the premium or special ships con uh, group in the 20th container if this does not occur after you open 19 containers. So this is the pity function where you are guaranteed to get a ship after 20 containers. Now that's pretty crap. You have a 12% chance of winning a ship. So you should win a ship every 8 containers. Every eight containers, your ninth should have a ship. So that's kind of that. I would have bumped that up to 14 or 15. I don't know why they have it so high, but that's probably because people go in here and they, they'll come in here and they'll buy the 25 for a hundred bucks and basically kind of get screwed. But anyway, that's going to be another episode. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. Take care, stay safe. I hope to be on here a little bit more. I have a few I ship ideas that I'm looking to try out, and I hope to bring you guys along with it. Anyway, I hope to see you all next time.